honey buns, welcome back to my channel, Mississippi Girl Life. I am Tamika, just country Mississippi girl, born and raised, but is now living in North Carolina. All right, y'all. So, y'all see, this is my melon area. So, I got to get this cut and put back into containers um, because I like container gardening. And also, we found a snake. My son almost got bit the other day by a snake over by the fence area. Not in this area, but over by the fence area. Um, Summer saw her, but still didn't know what she was, you know, hitting at or whatever. And he was standing, and the snake was right beside him. Copperhead snake. So, I feel like it's my fault. I'm glad he did not get bit or anything, but I feel like it's my fault. Because I had been saying I needed to put the snake away down. To get the snake away. I, I kept forgetting to get it when I went to Lowe's or whatever. I was told to get some lime. Which I have to do that. But I wanted all this cut down. Um, either one works. But yeah. That's what I'm getting done right now. So I can put stuff down. Walk way. Yeah. Uh, popping. To come up here, y'all, because they were popping everywhere. I hate it, y'all, because I got a big melon. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, don't cut it. Don't try to just stay at the top. Let's see. I think that one is rotten. It's like if I saw just saw something. Saw something like what? Move? Green, yeah. Like move? Yeah, this way. Yeah, you get from over there. It could be a garden oh, snake. It could be. Y'all, we have copperhead. Here in North Carolina, copperhead snakes mm -hmm. is the thing so yeah okay y'all because i got so many little melons over here i think i'm gonna try something like propagating um i got a melon right there melon right down there i think i'm gonna try to propagate look i got melons right here you see that i think i'm gonna try to take some of these and propagate them into a whole thing um and see if i can try to save something so trying to find some with some roots and i'm gonna transplant them real quick and i know what i'm gonna put them in so i think i'm gonna try to do that and see how it goes you won't know until you try um but definitely look how this look look y'all and look y'all i had melons yeah, they, they just riding or some got to them. That's the second one you about to toss. Mm -hmm. And then I got that. You step you stepping on oh Lord. <laughs> it is not funny. This is one I'm gonna try to propagate it. He just walked and stepped all over the vibe. Polo thing. Is that one good? So this one right here. I'm gonna try it. And I have two down here. So I had melons and stuff in there, but that's alright. I'm going back to container. Because that's what I like. That's what you know. So I had melons. I got melons. It's just that, you know, I don't I can't deal with no snakes and whatever and I got my children out here. Alright. Alright, got another good one, y'all. Look. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Another good one. So got some melons. Like I say, I'm gonna replant this one right here. Um, Summer, get away. Yeah. I'm gonna replant that one. If I could get it to do what it do what it needs to do. Look, y'all, I know this one is not ready, but I'ma try it anyway. I'm not sure which one it is. It looks like it's my uh, personal, my sugar baby or something. So that one was in there. It looks really, really nice. But I'ma see how sweet it is. Still gonna try it. Still gonna try it, y'all. 
but yeah you can get melons you know i got my i got i'm getting melons it's just i gotta i want to convert back to my container okay look y'all i got a watermelon over here hanging i mean i'm happy about it look you know what's gonna happen next season look at that it is hanging y'all i'm see if i can find where it's hooked to and see if i can continue it by propagating it but look at that it is hanging y'all I also got my son weeding this area over here. By these um, buckets, y'all. I'm so happy to be getting back in a container. Look what the sun did. And I haven't been able to come out, so I got to clean all this up. Because we're getting ready for fall guard. All that stuff. So I got to clean all this up. I'm going to see what I can save off my chart. Because I got new ones coming. So I'm going to take all the old dead ones off. And... I'm just gonna start fresh. That sun has been too, too hot. Got a lot of my collard greens, the old leaves, something bit off from, but I see new ones. So, yes, I'm not gonna pull those up. I'm just gonna take all the old, let everything start fresh. So, I got him weed eating this area, and then he's gonna come back over here. Uh, since it's this area. What's wrong? What's wrong? Huh? What's wrong? Oh, it's, um, oh, come on. You playing with webs with a weed eater. Boy, if you don't get the door. Side track, be side track. He's in up here playing with a, a spider wheel with the weed eater. Boy, 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 boy. He cheering, he cheering, he cheering. He watching me too, like, because if he see a nothing, trust and believe, he gonna try. Ain't you? You and you like try stuff, don't you? Huh? You like to try stuff, don't you? He's in a lab, yeah. yeah. Trying everything. Let him weed eat that. Be careful. Yeah. Be careful. Hey y'all, so everything has been cleared out. But I'm about to do something. These that's in the ground, everything is finna go back in a container. Yup, everything. When I say I want to go back full container, I want to go back full container. So my muscadines and all this stuff is finna go in containers, okay? buckets i'm putting them in buckets until i can get bigger containers like those 17 gallon containers i got um i got um potatoes in i am going to put these stuff back in five gallon buckets i'm finna cut everything down to a manageable size that way everything will be ready for the fall time but that's what i'm about to do everything is finna go back in containers y'all i didn't get no blueberries this year normally when they in containers i get blueberries okay so yeah about to go ahead and get it done since i'm out here okay y'all so i wanted to show y'all this really quick before going out there to show y'all the outside so these are the melons that i pulled from the thing that wasn't already rotten and all that stuff so i got those right there and these two right here and these were some muscadine grapes that was on the thing. So, yeah. Oh, and got that one right there. These two watermelons are store-bought watermelons, okay? They not. <laughs> but these right here is the ones, the cantaloupe watermelon. I think this was going to be, it might have, well, no, it's going to be a, a cantaloupe. It's, it's, it's not ready. It might have been a cantaloupe or a honeydew. Because I did have honeydews out there. But, yeah, that's what I ended up getting. All right, y'all. So, this is what it's looking like. I'm gonna get out here and do some more stuff tomorrow. Um, but all that stuff was pulled up and everything. And I put this grow bag right here. Um, if y'all was in that live screen, then you know if you wasn't. So, um, Amazon Prime Day. Y'all remember that um, a couple weeks ago. Um, my friend that she grows had gifted me four. It was two packs. They was $10 for a two pack. So she bought me two um of the 100 gallon grow bags and then i went and bought me another pack of two um so i can have you know extra whatever so thank you that she grows i appreciate it girl i appreciate it but i put my blueberry plants in here um i didn't do the best job for the middle i'm gonna come back and do it it was hot y'all but the main reason if y'all was in that live i got i got discouraged i got upset because at the beginning of this video remember i showed y'all my greens and i told y'all i was gonna cut those down and because it was a lot of new ones and stuff like that well this is what's left of them you see some buckets has been missed missing so we have what one two three four five six seven eight 
at least eight buckets um, that are missing because <sighs> yeah my chars and my greens I had a lot of new growth on them was taken up then nobody asked me and they tossed my Swiss chars and these are my cold water crops I was gonna cut all the bad leaves off that was damaged by the Sun and I have a lot of new growth on them. so I just kind of feel some type of way like you know I, I, I grew these for a while you know and then yeah you got to build garden to understand so normally a run they asked me um but I had gotten to that point to where I tell everybody ask me what is what in the garden because I'm the one out here planting it and no I'm the one that knows how to garden in the house okay and nobody asked me and my stuff was thrown away okay so I was kind of discouraged on that but yeah um I gotta come and get okra I got a garden harvest to do like I was telling y'all um try to do it today may do it tomorrow we definitely got to do it tomorrow because i got some pretty okra on here i need to get um out here and water again because this heat just been crazy i got a lot of new growth on my swiss charts but y'all you know i had a lot of swiss charts so yeah so that's what it's looking like now look at this y'all this is swiss charts this is just some of them that was tossed my greens and stuff some has been thrown it's some over there that was thrown away i lost a lot of so i lost you know my greens i had like two or three plants in one bucket and right now i'm one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen and that's just that's just what's here because some got already had been um thrown away so a lot i lost a lot of them but hey it happened so I'm just ready to start my fall garden and so stuff. I gotta get another tarp so I can have more of my tarp all this. But I'm glad everything is going back to container just in time for the fall. Um, but yeah, I'm excited about my grow bags. I really, really am, y'all. I really am. So y'all, yeah. So I'm gonna end this video right here, y'all. Um, I got something new planned. Um, y'all will see that. Y'all see that something that's gonna keep me on schedule hopefully keep me motivated y'all because i'm struggling with motivation i am it's just too much i'm juggling okay and i'm just struggling with motivation so i got a plan for that and hopefully it helps somebody else okay hopefully sometimes we got to train our mental so with that being said y'all i'm gonna end this video right here don't forget to like comment and subscribe hit that notification bell so you're notified each and every time that i upload a video and i will see y'all in the next one if it's your host will y'all be safe okay bye